Hey, hey everybody, uh, we're going to go over how to set up a poll on your Facebook Live. I'm going to do this really quickly for you. So uh, just so you can see, uh, when someone goes to your Facebook Live, this is actually what they're going to see. And they can't actually see the percentage uh, if they don't have um, if they haven't voted yet. So it's enticing for them to vote so they can actually see what the, uh, what everybody's, uh, answer is. And then you can click out of that if you want. So we're going to go over here and I'm going to show you how to set that up. Creator Studio, uh, is where you want to go. If you don't have Creator Studio, I will give you a link on how to set that up as well. It's very easy. Just type Creator Studio in the search bar. And then uh, you're going to go over here and you're going to click on um, uh, schedule video or post or go live, however you want to do that. Uh, we can uh, go ahead and upload. We'll just uh, act like we're going to upload a single video. So that was actually the video we just looked at. So uh we're uploading a video we're gonna put our title we're gonna put our description we're gonna add our tags over here <clears throat> you can go over here click on subtitles and uh, you can actually add subtitles once this is uploaded but here's your polls um, so you click on polls and create poll uh, so here you will ask a question, um, do you like Coke or Pepsi? And of course, you want this to be uh, relevant to your topic. So, uh, you know, if you've watched uh, the, the video, how, how to nail a video in 60 seconds or less, uh, if you haven't seen that, you definitely want to uh, look for that. I'll actually try to uh, put that in the uh, link above as well. Uh, but I, I tell you, you have to ask a question to engage your audience and uh, it has to be covering, you know, the topic that you're covering in the video. So option one, um, uh, Coke, option two, Pepsi, and all you do is uh, start. It's going to automatically go to uh, the default setting as it's going to last for the first 30 seconds of the video. Now, let's say that you actually time this out and you know and you want to ask a question at the very end of the video. Maybe it was, um, have you ever done a Facebook Live? Uh, so you want to engage them at the end of a video. I don't suggest it because your viewers drop off um, throughout the video. So you're going to have most of your viewers in that 30 second window at the beginning of a video. So you, you want to try it there. Uh, but if you're doing something special, you can definitely put it in the middle, in the end, wherever you want. And then uh, publish results after the vote. Uh, that entices them to vote or they may never see it or um, you can schedule those uh, votes to be published. So uh, you would just hit save and um, that's going to add that. And then you can actually add another poll at the end of the video, if you put that one at the beginning, uh, or you can just leave the one and then hit done. And you're going to go back and you're going to start editing everything else on your um, thing. And that's still uploading, so it won't let me. I was going to show you how to do those. But that is how you do a poll uh on your facebook live and it's the same for a, a live video so exit without saving say we were going to um go live we can go over here and um, go to interactive and hit polls add a question and here's your questions and um, add a question. Do you like Coke or Pepsi? And uh, two answer options. You can actually add options if you wanted. Um, so you can do Coke, you can do Pepsi, or let's go ahead and add um, both and hit save. And there is your um, uh, 
your poll on your live video and then you can um, schedule or go live.